For the next several weeks, you can view work from some of our area's most creative young artists at the Chaffee Arts Center in Rutland. This is actually my piece right here. And we had to do, we do this special thing in art called the artist trading card, and we had to enlarge one of them. And so this is one of my enlarged pieces. Um, I painted it and kind of gave a little quote onto it because I really like poetry, so I thought I'd incorporate some of that into my art, into painting, and make it bright. Well, the face is gone, and it's important to leave the face out because it's to see the, like, the personality and not the person, you know? So people, like, when they see it, they, they know that's me because I wear dresses and bright socks and I'm always have a peace sign. So, <laughs> I mean, they recognize it as me, but they're not like, oh, that looks like Abby, so it must be Abby. It's about just kind of what I like, which is bright colors and socks. More than 350 pieces of artwork make up the exhibit, with more than 30 students involved. This year's student art show is unique not only for the amazing work on the walls, but how the show floor and walls were laid out. An exciting element of this show is that this show is by students. It was also hung by students. I had 18 students from Stafford's digital arts class. Karen Kaiser is their teacher and they were here Tuesday and Wednesday. And the first day we puttied and sanded and painted walls and we opened up all of the boxes of art and looked at it and started to decide a flow, how we would arrange things so that people wanted to go from gallery one to two to three and were enticed right up the center staircase to the second floor. And then, uh, so it was a great experience for the students. They not only have work in the show in gallery one, but they got to be here for three days, some of them getting to actually hang the show. For the artists showing off their work, the annual exhibit is a way for them to share their thoughts and creativity with the community. I think it's a good community thing to have people come out here from all different types of schools. It's a really good kind of community building type of thing because, like I said, it gets people out into the community. It helps you know students and kids feel good about themselves, about what they're doing, and I think it also helps support art programs within the schools, which is also a really good thing. And I just love that I can, you know, that people like me and like my friends from other schools can have their pieces all kind of put into one place so we can all come and see each other and say, oh my gosh, you know, your art looks great. And, you know, everyone else can come and we can watch from afar as random strangers say, oh, I really love this piece. <laughs> you know, confidence. Art is an expression. Art is about expressing human emotion. Not every piece appeals to everyone, but that's true of books, literature, music. Um, art encompasses all of us, and it's, an, it's an, the opportunity for the student to share some of their emotion with the audience, and it's for us to stop and ponder and wonder the child's thought process as they were creating this piece. The student art show is open until the beginning of May. We try to keep the students' work together as a body, so when parents come in, they can look and find Rutland Intermediate or West Rutland Elementary, and they can find not only their child, but their children's friends who happen to be in the show as well. In May, the downtown Chaffee will have an exhibit titled Under 30. Artists interested in showcasing their work can contact the Chaffee for more information.